All right. So we're going to factor this one by grouping specifically, so no distribution necessary. Again, we've got two terms here separated by the plus between them. Here we go. So this first term, we've got a 3x and an x plus 5. That's nice. So factoring this out, we've got 3 times x. Uh, hopefully no surprises is right here. So the 3 is prime and none of those others are squared. And then in the purple, we've got the 6 y times x plus 5. But the 6 can be split up into 3 times 2 times y times x plus 5. So now when we look at the greatest common factor, we get a 3 and an x plus 5 in parentheses. So the greatest common factor, 3 times x plus 5, I mean, if it really helps, you can put that in parentheses. Most people don't like that, though. And then inside the parentheses comes what's left of what we started out with. We had the x, and we had the plus, and we got the 2y. So there we go. So if we wanted to check this just to make sure, which we should do, First, I would distribute the 3 into this parentheses right here. Uh, um, maybe I wouldn't. So, <laughs> and that's, that's just because the way that, that original one's written, those jerks. So, I would distribute this like this in here. So, I would have 3x plus 5 times x. And then I would have this added to, and I'll distribute, again, what's in those blue parentheses to this 2y. So 3x plus 5 times 2y, like this. Now when I combine, well, I guess simplify this, the 3 and the x can come together. So again, I'm just moving stuff around really at this point. And x plus 5 which is what that first term was. Um, and then I'm going to add this to... So I'll move this around 3 times 2 times y times x plus 5. And 3 times 2, that's a 6. And that's what we started with. Uh, if, if you wanted to, though, to check, you could distribute up here in those two terms. See what that is, and then... You could distribute the 3, and then whatever you get out of that, you would distribute into this parentheses. Yeah, you do FOIL on that. Very good. Uh, but I, I don't know which one's easier for you. It's something you'd have to decide.